Before we get into this video, you might recognise my face from a certain advert which has just been aired by Panini. It's about being part of something big, something really special. The brand new Panini Premier League sticker collection. Ready to go again? The official Premier League 2021 sticker collection for Panini, out now. Come on! Did you spot me? But yeah, I'd just like to give a massive thank you to Panini for getting me involved in the advert. It's so surreal. It's something I've always kind of wanted to be a part of. And it's actually happened. And it was with Ian Wright. It was mad. So thank you very much to Panini. Chris, if you're watching this, thank you. And um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hello everybody and welcome to a 20 pack dream team opening for the Panini Premier League 221 sticker collection. Um, I'm very excited to get into the video and of course before we get into this video, thank you very much for 50,000 subscribers. Whether you subscribed a minute ago or you subscribed five years ago, your support on this channel is massively appreciated beyond belief. So thank you once again for subscribing to the channel and joining the GBW Army. And uh, why not? Let's go for 100k this year. Why not? Before we get into the opening, if you're excited to get inside 20 packs and see what dream team we can build, make sure to smash the like button. You've got five seconds. Really easy to do. All you do is click a button. And I know you lot can click a button because you've all cl clicked that subscribe button. Brilliant. Let's get into the video. So here we go, let's get straight into the first pack. This is a dream team opening, not a draft one, so we can pick as many stickers from the pack as we want, which is quite exciting. And uh, without further ado, let's see how we do. Here we go, so these content ones we can't use, obviously. It's the same rules apply to the draft, except you can pick multiple stickers from a pack, basically. Uh, so there is Four Nails and Snodgrass, the duo we can't use either there of Tottenham. Mason Greenwood, that's not bad, not bad start. Bertrand Traore and Ryan Fredericks. We'll put Fredericks in at the back. And Mason Greenwood up top because he's a forward. Fantastic stuff. Right, let's put the discard pile to one side. And let's get straight into the next pack. Here we go. It'll be interesting what formation we'll end up going for this time. Saka, that is nice. Nice little midfielder there. Pepe. Uh, Jimenez, we're going to have to put him in. And Ings, wow, we'll put both of those in. Pepe, I don't think he's going to get in, but Saka definitely will. Fantastic player, he can go out wide there. And it looks like already we're going for a 4 3 3, which is fantastic. We love a 4 3 3 on this channel, you know that. There's Kiko Casilla there for Leeds United, not bad. Uh, the West Brom duo for Fana, Domit, and Jake Livermore. Do we want Jake Livermore? Yeah, we'll put Jake Livermore in as our captain. And then we'll put Wesley for Fana in, why not? Uh, Kiko Casilla. And Paul Dummett. So we're doing really well. We've got some decent little players in there. Just need one defender and one midfielder. Then we've got the team built. And then from then on, we can make as many upgrades as we want. Uh, so who we got in this one? We've got Berardi there of uh, Leeds United. Another Leeds sticker there. It's the duo. And we've got Gabriel Jesus. Decent. Might have to go for him. Uh, Lalana star signing. And Ampadu uh, for Sheffield United. We'll put him in. He's got a bit of European experience, being at Leipzig on loan last season. Uh, who else do we want to go with then out of this pack? Lana, maybe. We might as well put him in, in midfield, since we've got space. And Gabriel Jesus, I think, is definitely going to get in. I'm going to put Gabriel Jesus in instead of Danny Ings, I think. There we go. Uh, sorry, Daniel Ings. I feel really bad, but there we go. We could go for a 4-2-4, but oh well. So, into this next pack we go, and we've got uh, Sean Longstaff there, the West Ham duo, Abamian captain, Son key player, and Romain Sawyer's key player. Ooh, this is difficult. Well, we're going to take Livermore out and put Sawyer's in, so we've got a nice little upgrade in the shiny department. Uh, Human Son's going to have to go, and I think he's a forward in this collection, so he's going to go in instead of Mason Greenwood, and Abamian's going to come in instead of Jimenez. And that front three is shaping up very nicely indeed. That is fantastic. What a team this is so far. Looks like we are going to stick to the 4 3 3 as it goes. Will we put Scott Carson in goal? Hmm, probably not. Uh, there's the Liverpool kit. Lanzini, that's a nice need for the collection. That Regulion and Thomas Suchek. He's actually doing really well this season, so we're going to put him in instead of Lalana. There we go. Regulion can go in as well instead of Paul Dummett. Regulon, should I say. I always get that name wrong. And we'll put Lanzini in instead of Romain Sawyers. There we go. That is not bad, obviously. Uh, three West Ham players in this team now, by the way. So if you're a hammer, you, might, you best love me. And so here we go into this next one. We've got Damari Gray there. For Leicester, I don't think he's going to get in. Mares. 
Ooh, this is uh, going to be a tough little decision. Iosi Perez and Ben Davies there for Spurs. He's been playing a fair bit recently. Do I put him in? I'm going to put him in instead of Ethan Ampadu, I think. Um, so it's you know it's quite an attacking uh, back four at the moment. Iosi Perez, I don't think we're going to use, nor uh, Damari Gray. So sorry, Leicester fans. Can't use that content sticker. Mares is tempting. So maybe we take a defender out. Let's put, yeah, let's put the four in midfield. So we've got a 4-4-3 four, four, at the moment. So we can't do that. Maybe we take a striker out. Do we take Gabriel Jesus out? I think I will. I'm going to do it. Jesus is out. That's the team so far. I want to upgrade the defence. Build a good defence. And we've got a solid midfield brewing as well. Uh, so in this next one, we've got Button. Uh, Ashley Westwood, Donny van der Beek, nice, Del Stevens and Shimakash. Shimakash won't get in because he never plays. Uh, Donny van der Beek can definitely get in instead of... That's a tough one again though, isn't it? We'll put him in instead of Lanzini. Here we go. I'll keep changing my mind. But this is the, the joy of Dream Team videos. It's uh, it's more you know more freedom than the draft ones. Uh, there's a Jai there. Uh, Martinez, that's tempting actually. Cracking goalkeeper. Gilbert... Gary Cahill and Eddie Nketia. I think we're going to put Gary Cahill in as well. Move Ben Davies to fullback. Put Ryan Fredericks on the sub bench. Uh, Gary Cahill at the back. And Emmy Martinez in goal. That is not a bad team so far, if you ask me. We're doing pretty well. Let's get into the next one. Obviously, we're opening 20 packs in this video. And thank you very much to Solve Collectibles for sending over the packs to open in this video. Solve Collectibles are selling the Panini Premier League 2021 sticker packs, tins, the starter pack and the hardback albums. So if you're looking to buy packs from the collection, be sure to head to www.solvecollectibles.com and use the discount code GBW10 for a 10% discount. Also, from now until the 21st of December, if you make a purchase of over £5 from their website, you'll be entered into a huge Christmas giveaway in which you'll have the chance to win a share of over £500 in prizes. Oh, I'm not sure about any of those actually, apart from Dwight McNeil, he's the only one who's uh, kind of tempting me, but other than that, I think I'm going to keep it the same. There we go. You're probably hating me in the comments right now, but I think that's a sensible decision from myself. Um, there we go, then we've got Vidra, Johnny Otto. Well, we know where this guy's going to go. Right into the team. What a player. Get in the team. Who's he coming in instead of? Should we put him instead of Van der Beek? Because Van der Beek, well, he's his eventual for Man United. Fabian Scher, cracking little decision. And Hoiberg! Ooh! Right, so Suchek can... Oh, that's really tough, though. Right, hang on. Let's put Hoiberg in. Maybe we go for three at the back. I'm tempted to go three at the back, actually. Yeah, let's do it. So, let's take out Ben Davies. And who else do we take out? We'll take... Oh, Fofana or Gary K. We'll put Keith Gary K here with the experience. So, that is the team so far. That is an insane team. Look at that team so far. So we've gone for a 3-5-2 now, and it's looking pretty decent. Going forward, this team excites me. We just need a few better centre-backs, maybe, and to go at defence. But apart from that, it's looking decent. There's James Tomkins, Magic Moment. Ben White, tempting. Kevin Long and Pedro Neto for Wolves. Do we go for Ben White? Who do we put him in instead of, though? I kind of want to yeah, let's keep let's keep it the same. Ben White obviously had a cracking season last year for Leeds uh, as they got promoted to the Premiership. Anyway, in this next pack, Carl Walker, ooh, La Celso as well, Ward Prowse, and Jimenez Elite. That would be the first Elite we've got in this video, and obviously he's you know he's he's still recovering from his head injury, and hopefully he doesn't have to retire because that'd be and uh, that'd be very sad indeed because what a player he is, uh, Raúl Jimenez. But who should we go for? Should we go for... We'll go for Carl Walker. We'll put him in instead of Gary Cahill. There we go. A bit more pace at the back there. Ooh, I don't know. Ward Prowse is a good player. He is a decent little player, but I don't think he's going to get in instead of the players we've got there already. Um, no. There we go. It's on the pile now, so I can't make any late decisions. I'm sorry, Saints fans. Oh, we'll see Southampton recently beating Liverpool. Incredible scenes. There's Nathan Ake there. Star signing Van der Beek. Tyler Roberts and Yeri Mina. Hmm. Ooh, this is, this is going to be a difficult decision, isn't it? Uh, Yeri Mina and Ake are very tempting choices here. We could go for them two. I think I am, yeah. I'm going to take out Reguilon and uh, Cher and put in Ake and Yeri Mina. That is a decent defence right there. Three at the back. And we've got wing backs there, potentially. I don't know if Mara's will be a good wing back, but... Uh, 
we can vibe with it, we can work with it. Ooh, hello there. Jordan Henderson Captain Shiny sticker. I think it kind of picks itself really, doesn't it, that sticker. Uh, Danny Chabios. How do you expect me to make a team here? This is this is getting nasty now. Jason Steele and Theo Walcott. I don't think those two will get in instead of the players we've already got. Apologies, you're going to have to watch the rest of the video without face cam because I've run out of storage on my phone, which is what I record face cam with. So apologies for that. Very Tim Pot of me. But uh, anyway, so we need to fit in these two Liverpool players. And how are we going to do that? Right, let's take Suchek out and put Henderson in. There we go. And then Mo Salah. Interesting decision. Maybe we take out one of the midfielders. Do we take out Saka or Mares? Who's playing more? Saka's playing more, isn't he? Let's do that. Let's do that. So, Saka on the right, Eze on the left. And look at that front three. Blimey. Right, let's get into the next pack. Apologies about the face cam once again. It is uh, not ideal, but uh, storage banter. Can't do much about it. So, Jack Grealish. Oh my goodness me, this is going to be difficult. And we've got an elite, another so two Jack Grealish shinies in one pack. Is that a first? Surely it is. That is insane. Uh, Ryan Frey's there in the Leicester badge. Right, we're going to have to put Gra uh, Grack, <laughs> Grack Grealish in. Uh, Jack Grealish, let's put him in. Who instead of, I think time is up for Bukayo Saka. Sorry, Sax. Let's put Jack Grealish in. There we go. That is a decent team. And we've got Tim, uh, Timothy Castagna in this pack. Declan Rice, aka Solve Collectibles. There he is. Blimey, the resemblance is uncanny. Uh, so he's definitely an option. Uh, Van Dijk and Pablo Hernandez. Now, Leeds fans will hate me for not picking him, but uh, I can't really. Um, but we're going to take out Yuri Mina and put in VVD. Yeah, I think we'll keep it the same, actually. Declan Rice, I'm sorry, but you're not going to get in. Uh, I'm going to keep Hoiberg in because he's having a fantastic season uh, so far for Spurs. Uh, into this next pack we go. And we've got a magic moment for Leeds there, which we can't use. Stuart Dallas. Uh, Helder Costa. It's telling me to pick a Leeds player. And uh, then Nelson Semedo finishing off that pack again, though. I don't think any of them are going to get into the team ahead of what we've already got. And I know a lot of people are going to hate me for keeping Eze in. But trust me, he is the best player in the Premier League. So um, I cannot really take him out. Uh, but there we go. Let's get into this next one. Furlong, former QPR player as well. James Madison, Billy Sharp captain, and Hugo Lloris captain. Do we keep Lloris or do we go for Emiliano Martinez? Well, the other players I don't think are going to get in. James Madison, obviously a decent player, but instead of what we've got, I don't think so. And uh, captain Hugo Lloris instead of Martinez. That's the only predicament I've got right now. Ooh, I think I'm going to keep Martinez in, you know. Anyway, let's get into this final pack. A lot of people probably hating me for not picking Lloris, but there we go. Let's see what we can get in this last pack. Will we make any last-minute additions or substitutions? There's uh, Yarmolenko there, Tammy Abraham, Dean Henderson, and Marcus Rashford. Oh, I was hoping in the last pack we got absolutely nothing to write home about, but Marcus Rashford is the opposite of that. He is a forward. Purely based on goals this season, I'm going to take out Aubameyang and put in Marcus Rashford. So that is the front three. That isn't bad at all. And obviously, we've missed out a few decent players in this one, such as Lloris, such as Aubameyang, Madison as well. But that is the team we've gone for. So we've got Emmy Martinez in goal, Nathan Ake, Carl Walker and Virgil van Dijk at the back. We've got Elite Jack Grealish, Pierre-Emile Hoiberg and Jordan Henderson, Captain Shiny Sticker in midfield alongside the main man, Abire Eze. And then, of course, up front, we've got Human Son key player, Marcus Rashford and Mo Salah. That is not a bad team at all, if you ask me. We've got some decent players potentially for the bench, such as these two right here, Aubameyang and Lloris, and then one more potentially, I don't know, probably James Madison. Uh, so it's been a very difficult decision making, uh, making this team because we've got some pretty decent players. But yeah, let us know where you would have done things differently in this opening. And of course, while you're down there, uh, commenting down below, make sure to smash the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit notification bell next subscribe button. Reason being, you'll get notified to your mobile, tablet, and computer device when I upload a new video. Crazy, right? I know. Thank you very much for tuning in, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks once again for 50,000 subscribers. Goodbye.